Today is a very special day, not only for Arukailo, but also for most of us that have associated with you and the office of the Vice President. I am overwhelmed by the achievements of um, Arukaino. It's really a pleasure to be here today for the formal presentation and book launch of the Memory of Season, a collection of poems by Ruki or Arukaino Umukolo, speaking of nationhood, faith, life, and humanity. How can we become more intentional, with an emphasis on the word intentional, about turning our diversity into our strength? For me, it's about those national narratives that we can put together and just continue to amplify, showing that the things that unite us are more than the things that divide us. A lot of media houses who are still going by the ethics of a profession, they realize that there must be a housing first before you can actually practice your trade or you know, have a profession. In unity and strength, where well, diversity is added for the glory of all, and every problem is true. This is my imagination. But it's left for us all to forge a strong and vibrant nation. Our unity we must uphold. Then, glory again be we behold. It is our choice at most to build a truly great nation. Youngsters have made innuendo and nuance useful in such a way that they can be as vulgar and as intelligent and the census board full of old geezers who have no clue what they're talking about. This Nigeria of our imagination is possible for as long as we have the likes of Ruki in whose hearts burn brightly the reality of this new nation. I want to say thank you again to Aruka Ino for adding another book that supports and promotes unity in the country. I can't wait to have my students in my leadership club in Nigeria get a hold of your book. This is a further credence to what we've been saying, that there is no other place like home. If I didn't win anything, you are the biggest win for me being here. Stay passionate about Nigeria. Thank you to all the panelists too, and all my friends who came from far and near to support me. God bless you all.